Hello, and welcome back to Gator Life. And Happy New Year. Nick, we're way past that. Never mind. As you know, I'm Nick Lucarini, and this is my friend, Coleman Monahan. We have some very interesting segments for all of you. First, we'll take a look at the 7th and 8th grade game night, and then the 3rd grade wax museum. Why wait? Let's get right into it. Roll the intro. My name is Marie Antoinette. I'm Elizabeth Blackwell. My name is George Washington. My name is Walt Disney. I'm Cleopatra. My name is Malala. My name is Michael Jackson. I'm Mother Teresa. Hello, my name is Princess Diana. I was born July 1st, 1961. I was born in 1879. Hi, my name is Neil Armstrong, and I was born August 5th, 1930 in Wampakoneta, Ohio. I was born in July 12th, 1997. I was born January 26, 1961. I was born on August 29, 1958. I was born in 69 BC. I quit farming to lead an army of men and boys who had never been soldiers before. When I was a teenager, I became the queen of France because I married King Louis August. So, how do you think third grade is doing with the wax museum? I think the third graders are doing a fabulous job. Everybody memorized their speech and was able to recite it very well. They're having a fun time. The third grade did a great job. They sure did. Now let's take a trip back to the junior high game night. Planning game night with the student council has been so much fun. All the student council members have been putting in so much work um, as far as the fifth and sixth graders coming up with trivia questions for the trivia round and kids bringing in games and as far as the setup and the organization of the whole event and it really came together just so well. Kids are having a great time with trivia night. It looks like everybody's having a lot of fun and they're all working together to answer the questions. The 2012 U.S. Women's Gymnastics Team took the gold medal and were nicknamed the Fierce Five. Name as many members of the Fierce Five as possible. You get one point for each correct answer. <laughs> Two, one, unveil your answers. What do we got? We got Ryan. All right. Ladies, they have Michaela, Jordan, Gabby, and Allie. That is four points for the ladies. Four points? Yeah, and then three points. Five. The answer was, do we have it? Oh, we lost. How many do you have? We got four. Let me see the names. Gabby, Stephanie, Tori, and Molly. That is one point. Gabby Douglas, Allie Raceman, Michaela Maroney, Kyla Ross, and Jordan Weaver. Alright, you raise those boards, last question for you guys. Question. Uh, trivia was really good, um, a lot of fun. I uh, had three questions to answer as much as we can. Um, ladies beat us this round, and hopefully we can take it home. Trivia was a lot of fun because it just, it was exciting and you had to come up with something out of nowhere and there was teamwork. Hello, 
and it's game night. We're here in the cafeteria, and we're in the midst of playing board games, and they're having a grand time. We have apples to apples, giant Jenga, chess, giant cards. They're having a great time. It's been a great night so far. So we're playing charades over here. Lauren's going, and in the gym straight ahead for me, they're playing beach volleyball, and the boys are, I think they're playing Uno, and I'm having a lot of fun. All right, we're here at game night, and we're playing Jumbo Jango. What do you have to say about it, Matt? Um, it's really fun. <laughs> it is really fun, and the blocks are really big. Yeah. We're having a great night here at Anchile Assumpta Academy as the 7th and 8th grade are taking each other on in beach volleyball. It's really suspenseful. I have to say at this point it looks like the 8th grade has the edge, but I think the 7th grade has the enthusiasm to come back. That sure was fun. At any rate, that's all for this month's Gator Life. We'll see you guys next time.